Yo, what's up guys? It's Noah here. Uh, and in today's video, we're going to be talking through some NBA player props I like for today, guys. For Tuesday, um, October the 24th, the opening night of the NBA season. We got a two-game slate for opening night. I'm super excited to be talking NBA again with you guys and just kind of talking through slates, sharing props I like every day. Uh, for this video specifically, guys, we're going to give out two props that I do like for tonight's two-game slate. I would recommend playing a little bit lighter tonight since it is the first night of the season and there are only two games. Um, it's a little bit tougher to find you know, a ton of props to love when there's only two games you know, to choose from. We do have a really big slate though on Wednesday. I think there's 12 games on Wednesday. Uh, there will be plenty of props to like then and I'll, obviously I'll be making a video for Wednesday slate. I'll be making videos for NBA all season. The only days that I probably won't make videos for NBA are probably on Sundays because I'll just be doing NFL stuff on Sundays. Uh, but I'll be trying to make NBA videos, you know, Monday through Friday if possible. Definitely on the days where we don't have NFL. So like Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, I'll for sure have NBA content up then. Um, but I'm super excited for the NBA season, man. NBA is my favorite sport. It's been my most profitable sport for both DFS and for, for player props. And it's just, you know, it's a fun sport to talk about. It's a fun sport to watch. And it's one that I, I do enjoy betting on as well. So Let's talk through the, the two props I do like for, for Tuesday night slate. Now, uh, before we do that, guys, just real quick, make sure you guys do hit that like button down below if you enjoy these prospects videos, if they help you out. Make sure you hit that subscribe button as well if you have not yet. And if you guys are new to the channel and if you have never checked out prize picks before, you guys can actually sign up for prize picks and use my promo code, promo code NOAH, when you do sign up. Uh, you will get your first deposit matched up to $100 when you sign up for prize picks with my promo code. Um, and I do want to say that right now, Prospects does have a free square available for uh, Tuesday night's NBA games. This will be the last time I say this. Uh, if you take a look uh, on the screen right now, Steph Curry, his points prop is set at 0 0.5. And that's a free pick that Prospects is giving you. Obviously, take Curry to have more than 0 0.5 points. And then just find any other picks you'd like to pair with that. You can pair just one pick with that free square and make a two-pick entry. Or you can pair up to five picks with the free square and make a six-pick uh, six entry potentially win 25 extra money. It's really just kind of up to you on how you want to play it. But you can take a look at the board, find some props you like, or as always, you can tell me if you want to do so. But make sure you guys use that free square while it is available. It'll be available until uh, Tuesday night, 10 p.m. Eastern time when that Suns and Warriors game starts. And if you guys don't have an account on Prospects yet, use that promo code NOAH. Get your first deposit matched up to $100. And I do also want to give a shout out to Sleeper because Sleeper also has a free square available for the NBA season. They have Clay Thompson's points prop set to 0 0.5. And if you guys don't have an account on Sleeper, uh, you can sign up for Sleeper as well. Use promo code NOAA over there. Get your first deposit matched up to $100. And Sleeper, very similar to Prize Picks and a lot of these other pick'em sites on Sleeper. You know, you're picking over or under on player projections. Uh, but Sleeper does offer a dynamic payout system. So what that means is basically Sleeper, you know, the odds um, of a play hitting or the payouts you get will you know differ based on the odds of a certain play hitting. So if a play has a high chance of hitting, you know, the payout might be a little bit lower. But on the other hand, if the play has a, a you know low chance or a, you know low chance of hitting, if the, if let's say you take the over and the over is heavily favored, well then you could also you know look at it the other way, take the under, get a higher payout for that you know multiplier. So sleeper does offer like a two two x multiplier or two x two point five x sometimes three x multiplier on certain plays. And sleeper does offer a lot of props that some of these other sites can't offer. Obviously, Prize Picks. You know, they want all their props to pretty much be even money because it's a fixed payout and you know the props, you know, the, the payouts don't change based on whether you take the over or the under. So Prospects has to put out props that are basically even money. Well, on Sleeper, you can play pretty much anything. You know, they can do all kind of props. You can take like triple doubles, over, under on triple doubles. Obviously, that's something that Prospects doesn't really offer. Uh, double doubles as well. Sleeper has a lot of props. Some of these sites don't offer. So if you guys are not on Sleeper yet, use that promo code NOAA. When you sign up for Sleeper, you'll get your first deposit matched up to $100. And be sure to use that free square over on Sleeper. You know, we want to be taking advantage of these promos when we can. And a lot of these sites are giving out promos for the start of the NBA season. You want to take advantage of those you know, while they are available. But let's go ahead and talk through this uh, slate for prize picks. Two games, guys. Two props I'm liking. We're going to be looking at two points props for this game. And the first uh, one we're going to look at we're going to start off in the Lakers-Nuggets game. I do have a play that I like from each game. So you'll have something. Um, if you're telling me on this entry, you'll have something to sweat from each game. So that'll be fun. But the first play we're going to talk about is going to be Austin Reeves' points prop of 14.5. And, and I like the over here uh, for Austin Reeves, more than 14.5 points. So right now, if you look on DK Sportsbook, and if you look at like a lot of sportsbooks, uh, like on Pinnacle, on DK Sportsbook, they have this line set at 15.5. Now on DK Sportsbook, it is, you know, Juice is slightly favoring the under, minus 125 favoring the under. 
but we're getting some value on prize picks with this line at 14 and a half, whereas pretty much every sports book I, I look at has their line on Reeves at 15 and a half. You know, Reeves we saw be a really good scorer last season for the Lakers. He had a really good role for this Lakers team. He was really good in the postseason, and he was really good in the preseason this year. Now, take it with a grain of salt because Reeves did only play three games in the preseason, but in the three preseason games he played, he looked really good. He was really sharp. He played 20 minutes against Brooklyn, had 18 points on 5 for 7 shooting, 4 for 6 from 3, got to the free throw line, shot 4 for 4 from the free throw line. In 24 minutes against the Warriors, he shot 6 for 9, 1 for 2 from 3, and had 16 points. And then in 24 minutes against the Suns, he shot 4 for 8, 3 for 4 from 3, and had 14 points. So in 24 minutes or less played during the preseason, Reeves had 18, 16, 14 points. Highly efficient shooter. His efficiency was really good in the preseason. He was also able to get to the free throw line at least three times in all three of those games. We saw Reeves be really aggressive as a driver last season, especially in the postseason. He was driving to the basket a lot. He was drawing a lot of fouls. So he has a lot of ways that he can score. It's not like he's just a spot-up shooter and he's going to stand in the corner. Like Reeves is someone that can create his own shot. We saw that last season. He's an efficient shooter. He can drive to the basket. He can draw fouls. He's going to have a good role on this Lakers team. And while the usage is going to be dominated by LeBron and AD for the most part, Reeves is still going to be out there for a ton of minutes. His, his you know, minutes should be very secure here. I would assume that if this game is competitive, we're going to see Reeves play 32 to 35 minutes, kind of somewhere in that range. Uh, minutes are not going to be like super, super high on guys to start the season. Um, but if the game is competitive, you could see minutes get ticked up a little bit. LeBron, he typically plays like 35, 36 minutes on opening night. I was looking at some of his opening night stats. I think we're going to see similar minutes for Austin Reeves. You know, obviously Reeves is a young guy. He can handle playing, you know, big minutes. He played huge minutes in the postseason. Don't think he's going to play as many minutes in the postseason or in the you know, start of the season as he did like in the postseason last year. Uh, but he was really good last season with the Lakers as a you know, high-efficient shooter, a guy that can you know, score in multiple ways. He's going to be out there for a good amount of minutes as well. And the fact that all the sports books have this line at 15.5 and, and we're getting it at 14.5 on prize picks, that definitely makes me like this play as well. So that's the first play we're going to be rolling with for opening night is Austin Reeves, more than 14.5 points. And then the other prop that I like in the Suns and Lakers or Suns and Warriors game, excuse me, is going to be Kevin Durant's points prop of 26. And this is a, another over that I like. So more than 26 points for Kevin Durant. Now, Kevin Durant, if you look at DK Sportsbook right now, and if, again, if you look at all the sports books, you know, all the major sports books, DK, FanDuel, uh, Pinnacle, they all have Durant's uh, points prop set at 26 and a half. I know, you know, 26, 26, uh, 26 and a half. Obviously, there's not a huge difference there, but on the off chance that Durant does finish, you know, does finish with 26 points, well, getting this line at 26, it technically wouldn't be a loss. You know, if Reeves go, if Reeves goes over, and if Durant finishes with 26 points, we would still get a 1.5x payout. So there's definitely some value getting this line at 26 when all the other sports books have his line at 26 and a half. And we know what we're going to get from Kevin Durant, even though he's going to be you know, sharing the ball with Devin Booker and Bradley Beal this year. He's still going to be a dominant high usage player when he's on the floor. He's going to play big minutes. Durant has always been someone that can play big minutes. He can handle a, you know, a big workload. And I think it's a pretty good matchup against the Warriors. I think this is going to be a fast paced, high scoring game. If you do look at the two games on the slate and if you look at the totals, this game does have a, you know, this, the total in this game is six points higher than the Lakers and Suns game. 234 and a half total in this Warriors Suns game uh, with a um, one point spread. So it's expected to be a close game. It's expected to be high scoring. You look at pace stats from last season, the Warriors, they did play at the fastest pace in the league. Now the Suns, they were kind of a slower pace team last year, but I could see them picking up the pace this year now that they, um, you know, maybe now that they got rid of Chris Paul, maybe, you know, with Devin Booker running the point, maybe they will be a team that picks up the pace this year. We'll have to see. But the Warriors, they led the league in pace last season. They're, they're probably going to be another fast-paced team once again this year. And so it kind of makes sense to see this game have, have such a high total. And if we're going to be getting you know, 34, 35, 36 minutes from Kevin Durant in a game with a 234.5 total, we know Durant's going to get the volume. He's going to take probably close to 20 shots here. He's a highly efficient shooter. He's a guy that typically doesn't have too many off-shooting nights. And again, with all the sports books, having his line at 26.5, I like getting it at 26 on prospects. There is some value there. So... These are two props, guys, that I like for Monday nights opening or uh, for Tuesday nights opening night slate. Again, it's only two games on Tuesday night, so it's it's a little bit tougher. Um, you know, it's hard to find a ton of plays to love on just a two-game slate. 
but we'll have a big Wednesday slate. Like you can take a look at all the props that Prospects already has uh, already has posted for Wednesday. There's going to be a ton to like on Wednesday. I'll have another video for Wednesday slate probably posted later on Tuesday night. And again, guys, like I said at the beginning of the video, we're going to be making NBA videos all season, going to be giving out NBA props all season. Hopefully we have a good season, good profitable season. If you guys are going to be tailing me on these two picks for opening night, let's hopefully, you know, cash these plays, win some money tonight, and let's, hope, you know, try and have a great season this year. But as always, guys, appreciate you watching these videos and supporting, you know, the prize pick content and all the content that I post on YouTube. If you guys do enjoy these videos, uh, just as, as always, I do appreciate it. If you hit that like button down below, hit that subscribe button if you have not yet. And again, guys, go check out prize picks. Use that Steph Curry, uh, Steph Curry free square while it is still available. Uh, on Prize Picks, it'll be available until that Suns Warriors game does start. So you have all day to get it in uh, on Tuesday. And if you don't have an account on Prize Picks yet, use that promo code NOAA. You will get your first deposit matched up to $100 uh, when you sign up for Prize Picks with my promo code. But yeah, guys, super excited. NBA's finally here, man. Excited to be making content again for NBA. Let's have a great season. Uh, again, best of luck tonight, guys. Appreciate you watching the videos as always. And we will see you in the next one. Peace.